day, but of the Premier League begins the sport. Manchester City are uh, finishing off this uh, weekend's matches, and there's a goal that has come. Stoke City, cold Monday night in Stoke, but still Man City are leading because of a goal from David Silva, and City are in a good lead. They are controlling the game also. Uh, as you know, the Commonwealth Games are coming, and it's something we've been building up to for a long time. The Ghana team has finally departed from the country after months of preparation here. They're going to acclimatize down under. For me, history is being made because uh, I stand to be corrected. For a very long period, our athletes have not gotten the opportunity to go for pre-games preparation to enable them excel during the main event. It is for that reason that uh, we at the NSC would like to express our profound gratitude to the Minister of Human Sports for the support that they've given to this arrangement uh, when we presented a program through the International Games Committee to the Ministry uh, for preparation towards Commonwealth Games. The Ministry did not turn our program down, looked for the resources to help us prepare the athletes for the Commonwealth Games. Team Ghana is leaving today to Australia to continue with the final stage of preparation. Uh, it is for this reason that uh, we have met here this morning to give them farewell so that uh, they will go fully confident to go and represent the nation. There's more on the football show where we'll be having more local stories and also um, join us tomorrow morning for an update on Richard Comey and his fight with Robert Easter Jr. I'm Gary Al Smith. Easy. We'll finish up with the news shortly.